hello everyone we should discuss one problem here here the problem is check the controllability of the system so he directly asking the controllability controllability is related to input just keep you one keep in your mind and controllability is related to input and what about observability observability is related to output by using that we can use the formula so here first we should make statement state transition matrix first so for that just look at here this is the cross multiply here s cube plus 2s square plus 3s plus 4 will give some output y of s and it is equal to u of s make it in a s equation so s cube plus 2s square plus 3s plus 4 into y of s minus u of s is equal to 0. So this is the equation. From this we will write matrix. So first the state matrix here. Here the state matrix A. A equal. So here what is the order? Generally here the order is the 3. That means we have 3 by A matrix have the rank of 3 by 3 it has the 3 by 3 okay and so whenever the 3 by 3 matrix is there first start from here this is s power 0 we will get the minus 4 here next we will get the minus 3 here and here we will get the minus 2 here we will get the minus 2 here and next and you should write and uh, we should write 0 0 1 and 0 1 0 this is the shortcut method of the finding the matrix here okay so what about b b has only x3 we have the only x3 that's why b is right down here that is the 0 0 1 b is the 0 0 1 this is the state matrix and this is the input matrix this is the shortcut method then how to make a controllable matrix that is the qc qc is nothing but b a b and the a square b for that first we should find out a b and a square b so b you know that but what about a b so a b value is like this a into b so a value is a is 0 1 0 0 0 1 0 1 0 0 0 1 and minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 this is the minus 4 this is the minus 3 and this is the minus 2 this is the 0 0 1 so this is the a what about b what about b matrix b matrix is 0 0 1 0 0 1 so doing the multiplication what we will get 0 into 0 0 1 into 0 0 0 into 1 0 the first matrix is 0 1 what about this 0 into 0 0 0 into 0 0 1 into 1 1 we have the 1 here and what about remaining minus 4 into 0 0 minus 3 into 0 0 minus 2 into 2 we will get the minus 2 here 0 1 minus 2 and what is what is another thing we require the another thing is a square b a square b First, what is a in, for that a square b? What you should find out a into a first, then multiply with the b. Okay, so first we should I should find out the a square first. What is a here? This is the a 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 0, 1, and minus 4, minus 3, minus 2. This is the a matrix, and you should multiply this matrix with again a that is 0, 1, 0, 0, 0, 1 minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 so now you should do the some multiplication here what we will get for the a square so i will do here 0 into 0 0 and 1 into 0 1 into 0 0 okay and 0 into minus 4 you will get the 0 and what about this this one is over and 0 into 0 0 0 into 0 0 and you will get the minus 3 here okay 
and this is the first element so you will get the first element is like this 0 into 0 0 into 0 1 into 0 0 into 4 0 complete 0 next 0 into 0 1 into 0 0 into 0 you will have again the 0 element what about next 0 into 0 1 into 1 you will have the 1 element what about this 0 into 0 0 into 0 1 into 1 we have the minus 4 0 into 0 0 into 0 1 into minus 3 you have the minus 3 0 into 0 0 into 0 1 into minus 2 you have the minus 2 here and what about last minus 4 into 0 minus 3 into 0 minus 2 into minus 4 you have the minus plus 8 minus 4 into minus 4 okay this is the minus 4 and minus 3 into 0 means 0 and this is minus 3 into 3 minus 3 into minus 3 we have the plus 9 we have the plus 9 okay minus 4 into minus 4 3 into 0 minus 2 into 6 minus 6 sorry this is the minus 2 into 4 you have the minus 6 okay minus 2 into have we have the minus 6 second minus 4 into 0 minus 3 into 0 minus 2 into minus 4 we have the plus 6 sorry we have the plus 6 second we should go for the second sorry sorry this is wrong actually look at here for second terminal 0 into 0 and 0 into 0 1 into and first thing this is minus 4 into 0 minus 3 into 0 minus 2 into plus 8 okay minus 4 into 1 what we have minus 4 into 1 this is minus 4 into 1 is minus 4 minus 3 into 0 0 minus 3 into uh, minus 2 into this 6 we have the plus 6 okay next minus 4 into 0 okay and minus 3 into 1 minus 3 next minus 2 into plus 4 here plus 4 here so by solving this finally we will get the value is a square b value is 0 0 1 minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 and this is the 8 this is the 2 and 1 so this is the a square matrix so what we need to do we need to do a square into b a square into b so what we will get a square is 0 0 1 and minus 4 minus 3 minus 2 and this is the 8 2 1 what about b matrix b is you will get 0 0 1 so by doing the simplification what you get 0 0 this is the 1 0 0 this is the minus 2 0 0 1 finally we will get 1 minus 2 1 so finally what is qc here so you will get qc is you should write like this b matrix a b matrix and the a square b matrix so what is b matrix row column matrix what is the b 0 so what is the b is there 0 0 1 first is the 0 0 0 1 what is a b a b matrix is 0 1 minus 2 0 1 minus 2 what is a square b 1 minus 2 1 this is the 1 minus 2 1 so we are getting controllable matrix is this is what we need to find out we need to find out the modulation how we can find out the modulation so this should the modulation is like this here 0 into 1 minus 4 first thing is over again plus 0 into and this is the 0 and this is the plus 2 and you can take the minus here no problem and what about this plus 1 into 0 minus 1 so finally what we have we have some 
minus 1 minus 1 is not equal to 0 so we are getting minus 1 is not equal to 0 that's why the modulation is not equal to 0 whenever the modulation of controllable matrix is not equal to 0 then the system is the system is 100% controllable that means we can control the input by the controlling the input we can change the state of the system we can change the state of the system so whenever the given whenever he given in the transfer function model first you find out the transition matrix as well as input matrix and we know first you form a form a controllable matrix that is b a b a square b that's why you use state matrix and uh, input matrix then after that you will find out the a square after that you will find out the a square b using all these you will get b a b a square b after finding the controllable matrix you will go for to find the modulation of modulation of the controllable matrix so fi by finding that finally you are you are getting the minus one value minus one is not equal to zero so therefore the finally the system is 100% controllable so this is the processor to do the to test the controllability of the any system i hope all of you understand the session thank you